Hi there, today I'll demonstrate how to vectorize and color a sketch. So after you've inserted an image, lower the opacity so you can easily draw on it. Now form a new layer and start tracing on the image using the pen tool. Leave the fill color to blank, so it may not fill the shape while tracing. Drag the mouse while holding the mouse click so you can form curves at anchor points. After you're done forming a shape, hold Ctrl key and click anywhere to release the shape. With this technique you can easily draw all the basic shapes. To draw the toes, form a triangle using the pen tool, then click at each anchor point using direct selection tool and click the smooth conversion button to make it curved. You can then duplicate it and make a few changes to form remaining toes. To make the eye, first make the outline of the eye using the pen tool. Now draw the inner line. Then select both shapes and click exclude button on Pathfinder. It will form a hollow between the shapes. Then draw circles of your choice and arrange them behind this hollow shape to form the eyeball. After you're finished drawing, select the shapes and group them. Choose the Live Paint Bucket tool and fill in the colors of your choice in the shapes. To form shades, draw the curvatures on the shapes you want to be shaded using pencil tool. It doesn't matter if they go out of the shape, they'll be deleted afterwards. After forming curves, choose Live Paint and click the Merge Live Paint button, this way you can fill in those pencil curves with the shades you require. After filling in shades, select all shapes and click expand button. This will disable the live paint bucket and then you can delete the pencil lines. After you're done shading, you can put various blurs and artistic effects in the vector drawing from the effects tab. This will enhance the quality of your image. Your vectorized artwork is ready. Thank you for watching.